one bit of news to the next. Hello guys, Keep One TV here, back for yet another video. It's going to be a double upload to today. Um, so yeah, the news about Peclotet, that was the first bit of news today. The second bit of news is the championship fixtures have been announced. Um, and the first couple of games that are going to be on Sky have also been announced. So I've got the fixtures up here. Football is well and truly back after three months of lockdown. And I'm really happy to see it come back. Um, and the death rate is dropping, so I think it's the right time to come back. We've waited three months, um, and yeah, we passed the peak as well of COVID-19. So yeah, um, weirdly enough, uh, we've got West Brom away, but it's been played on a Saturday at 3pm. So we're going to be on Sky, that game is going to be on Sky Sports. I don't know what other games are going to be on Sky Sports, I'm not too sure. Um, I think... Season ticket holders get to stream every single game live for the last remaining nine games of the season. So West Brom away, a three o'clock Sky Sports on a Saturday. That's unheard of. I've never seen anything like it. A derby at three o'clock on a Saturday. Just imagine if that was Villa. Villa away. I don't know what they'll do. They'll probably move it to a Sunday, wouldn't they? But then we've got um Saturday. So Saturday the 20th of June, West Brom away, three o'clock kickoff. Then after that game, we have to wait a week to play Hull. On the 27th of June on Saturday. So we're going to July. Never thought I'd be saying this. But we're playing games in July. I mean not friendlies. Not friendlies. No championship games. So after Hull City we've got Huddersfield a couple of days later. Uh, midweek. Wednesday the 1st of July. Wednesday the 1st of July. Sorry. 7.45. Then three days after that we've got Fulham away at Craven Cottage. That's a three o'clock kickoff. Then we've got. Swansea at St Andrews, 7.45 kickoff on a Tuesday. So we're playing Saturday, Tuesday, you know, um, so a midweek game and then a week game. Um, so yeah, Swansea, 7.45 on Tuesday, 7th of July. Saturday, the 11th of July, we've got Stoke away. Tuesday, the 14th of July, we've got Charlton at St Andrews. Saturday, the 18th of July, we've got Preston away. And the, the season will be finished. I don't know why it says midnight. We're not going to be playing Derby County at midnight St Andrews, don't worry. But I don't think there's been a time set for the last fixture of the season. So, yeah, Derby at County is going to be the last game of the season that we play in the Championship. Peclotet's farewell, that's going to be. And, um, yeah, I mean, the season's going to be ending on a Wednesday. It's going to be a really weird ending to the season. Of course, we've still got an outside chance for... That's probably wrong, the wrong word. Um... We've probably got, there we go, breaking news, just come up there. We've probably got um a slim chance of making the playoffs. It's probably like a 10% chance. But yeah, um, the Premier League returns in uh, nine days. And the Championship returns in 12 days. We're one of the first teams to be playing in the Championship. Um, and yeah, Project Restart is fully underway. The fixtures are out. And um, yeah, we can really start looking, you know, we can look forward to uh, football returning um, it's been a long long time the previews and the reviews will be back um, and I'm just so ecstatic I mean the news about Pekla Tech though has put a bit of a damper on things but yeah uh, we're just going to move on haven't we but yeah anyway guys make sure to like share and also subscribe it's been Keep on TV like I said it's been a double upload day today and um, yeah what do you think about the fixtures leave it down in the comments you can't. I can't really say you're going to any because they're all going to be playing. They're all going to be played behind closed doors. Whatever it goes. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Keep on.